Thoughtful Thoughts Thursday. Yes, we almost made it. We've almost made it through the week. How are we feeling, Mr. Simon? Yeah, we're feeling good. We got basketball again tonight. Oh, oh so man. My voice is going to be gone a while. Oh, it's uh, gone. I <laughs> hope yeah. that we can like get you back in order. <laughs> Maybe a blessing in disguise. <laughs> <laughs> Not being able to talk. I don't know about that. <laughs> We miss your in We do. <laughs> well, today on Thoughtful Thursday, guys, I have my two wonderful and very thoughtful friends with me. I'm Miss Lindsay. Mr. Sizemore with CIS. And I am Miss Boswell, your school counselor. And today we are coming to you from Support You News. Now, today on Thoughtful Thursday, we have a couple of friends we'd like we to introduce. Miss Lindsay, would you like to introduce them? I would love to. Yeah, on great. Thoughtful Thoughts Thursday, we have Callie and Skyland. Come on in, friends, Come and say good girl. morning. Can you say good morning to Stonewall Jackson? Good morning. Good morning. Excellent. Are you guys ready to? <laughs> are you guys ready to share with us how to be thoughtful and considerate and work on some social skills today? Yeah. Excellent. Let's get started, friends. All right. So on thoughtful Thursday, Skylin, will you pull us a card out of here? Excellent. And will you give it to Callie? She'll read it for us. Share. How you make it made yourself feel better when you were upset. Okay, so have we ever been upset before? Mm -hmm. So what kinds of things do you do to help yourself feel better? This works on self-control, mm -hmm. right? So what kinds of things help you feel better if you're upset? What do you think? What do you do, Miss Kelly? I um I go talk to my mom. Okay, so talking to a parent, a teacher, moms are always good people yes. to talk to. What else do you do if you're feeling upset? If you're upset, Skyline, what do you do? Tell your mom. Tell mommy for sure. Do you ever play? What do you play? With toys. With toys. Do you have a favorite toy that makes you happy when you play with it? What is it? Oh, how <laughs> fun. Miss Lindsay, what about you? What helps you if you're feeling upset and you? I think for me, exercise is something that helps clear my head and maybe takes my mind off of the problem so that I can think about something else or think clearly about how to solve that yeah, problem. For or sure. talking to someone that I love helps me too sometimes to work through that and kind of find a solution, right? Sometimes yeah. we have to talk about it out loud yeah. to work through a solution. What about you? Absolutely. I, I'm thinking I'm very much on the same page with you and sometimes I just need a nap. Like, mm -hmm. I'm cranky and I'm upset and I take things too personally because mm -hmm. I am tired. Mm -hmm. So sometimes just taking a rest is a really good yes, thing absolutely. for me. And I always try to look at things from other people's perspective, you know. Um, we all see the world from different directions and sometimes we really have to take the views of what's coming up in different places. And I think this is why this is such a good question related to how we deal with being upset because we're upset from our perspective, mm -hmm. but what does that look like from other places? So that's that's one of the things that I try to do. Mm -hmm. Boys and girls, we thank you for being with us today on Thoughtful Thursday. Talk about this one in your class. What kinds of things help you? This is when we talk about zones of regulation, those triggers that happen, and then what tools do we use to help move us back into that green zone where we feel stable and calm oh. and, and in our best place. We will hear from you soon, and we love you to pieces. We hope you have a wonderful Thursday.